Good afternoon. It's working. That's good. So, uh, congratulations, you made it. And um, now, now we're just going to, first of all, we're going to have a demo from uh, Zach just showing uh, how much quicker Lenaro Android is than uh, vanilla Android. Um, then uh, the tech leads are going to, or Kiko is going to get the tech leads just to go through some of uh, the big achievements this week. Uh, and then we've just got a few thank yous at the end. And then uh, later on, we've got a closing party behind here. So. Zach, over to you. Yeah. All right, so over the last... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Microphone? All right, so, um, yeah, can everybody hear me in the back? Um, over the last three months, we've taken uh, technology from the working groups and the landing teams. And what I'm about to show you is uh, the result of, 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 of that, those improvements. So on your right will be a stock Android bill. This is effectively the Android kernel with the 4.4 toolchain that ships with the Google AOSP build. On your left is our build. So Brand X and Lenaro. What you see here on the left is 3.0 kernel, uh, 4.5 GCC from the toolchain group, and of course the kernel from the working group, and of course upstream, and um, and then OX uh, bench from OX lab. So we're gonna race them. So watch carefully. On your mark, get set, go. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I, I, Don't! No, I, uh, yeah, right. All right, Mark, get set, go. All right, so it's fast. So this is software decode, by the way. Uh, no hardware decode. Uh, the hardware decode is, anyway, I'll just look for this. You guys can watch it. Boring. <laughs> it's not boring. <laughs> 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 you keep talking about something. Yeah, yeah, okay, okay. So yeah, so the, uh, we 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 worked on this de we worked this demo up this week uh, to identify a, a combination that was kind of the best uh, the best of the best. So we did 4.6, and we also uh, did it with and without um, hardware acceleration, which means that uh, George owes Kiko a pound. Um, <laughs> And uh, and so of, of all the combinations, this was this was the thing that that showed um, that, that that had a that had a, a that had a, a difference. So while this is running, this is going to run for just a little bit longer. We also because we had to tear everything down at three o'clock, I figured, oh well, we have all these Android sets up setups. So let's just show them to everyone. So what we have is uh, over the course of the week, uh, Barrow and the team really really uh, hammered and uh, got the got IMX uh, 53 Android going. And then we also have a what we're now calling the staging uh, evaluation bill <laughs> running on, on Snowball that has, uh, and, and as Patrick tells me that each uh, Snowball is, is fairly different, so I don't know if this is a fast Snowball or a, snow, uh, a slow Snowball. We also have, um, we we're not we're just we've just set it out. This isn't this isn't Lenaro's Lenaro's origin build, but we we also made uh, made made some pretty good pretty good uh, steps to to get uh, origin up with with our our build. So anyhow, this is the fruits of our of uh, everyone's labor, and um, as you can see, you know it, there is there is a bit of a difference. So. So these are these are live, and people can come up and play with them. Um, the uh, IMX53 has an extremely cool bug that we can show people, and of course we can play with the with the, the snowball um, uh, when it's done. When it's done. Anyway, tell us how I made a pound. What's that? Tell us how I made a pound. Well, we were, you know, we're racing, and and there's a lot going on with these systems, right? There's, uh, you've got. I mean, you've got you've got you've got hardware accelerators. You've got you've got the, the apps processors. You've got all the decoders. You've got you know you've got code that, that that's been developed all over the world. And so it's it's comp there's complex systems, right? 
So the idea was that if certain improvements were made in the, in the tool chain, that if you had hardware decode in, that those improvements would actually come out better um, because you wouldn't necessarily be as memory bound. And so George and Kiko had a bet to see whether this was actually, you know, whether when you, when you actually put it into hardware, um, hardware graphics mode, whether you would see a bigger or, or, a, or a smaller uh, effect. And it turned out that since in our hardware mode we only support 1080p, you're, you're pretty much memory bound there anyway, um, or it's pretty much swamped by the, the amount of data uh, in the system, at least that's the theory. And, uh, and the, the effect was, was, was pretty close. So when they raised, it, it was pretty much, the, it, it, things pretty much transitioned at the same time. Um, but what this really shows is the power of, of what we've done you know, with the platform team and the infrastructure team, where we're able to make these builds extremely quickly and, and make these changes and, and really experiment with Android in that sort of way, right? We have good builds for 4.6, 4.4, 4.5, uh, I know I did that in weird order, but um, we have we have Android 2.3, we have Android 2.4, 2.3.4. Um, we're going to have Android 2.3.5. All these builds have been tested and are known to work. And so, really, people can actually look at these and actually look to see how things are improving around a platform. And nobody else has done that really. You know, the vendors are really just focused on getting the next platform out the door, so they're not doing it. And Google's just worried about getting. The next Google device out the door, so they're not doing it. So we really are, you know, this is a value add. Having these platforms is a value add, and people that are interested in general Android improvements and, and the work that Lenaro is doing, this is a good demo because this is real. You know, the Tool Train Group did not write code to improve a benchmark, and the Kernel Group did not write code to improve a benchmark. This is just the the effect of general, you know, community involvement and and you know just generally good engineering so anyway there we are thanks very much sir. Yeah.